and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be diving into something a little bit more lifestyle and a little bit less beauty. I have rounded up my lifestyle essentials. So these are things ranging from fitness to socks to random stuff that I need personally in my life that I think are kind of overlooked. Just random things that I use, that I have in my house, that I rely on for different purposes and different needs. And I thought, why not sit down and kind of film and share with you. Without further ado, don't forget to please subscribe to my channel. Hit the notification bell so you know when I post typically Wednesdays and Saturdays at 9 a.m. Pacific time. And without further ado, if you wanna see it, my lifestyle essentials, then let's go ahead and get on into it. Okay, so I seriously have the most random assortment of things. I am going to start off with, um, I guess, the thing that kind of inspired this whole thing. That's kind of what I start off these collection videos with things that just inspire me to do the videos in the first place. So I want to talk about this. This is magnesium oil. I have a friend at work who makes fun of me for this because he thinks it's a total gimmick. Isaac, you know who you are. But no, seriously, this helps me tremendously. This is um, a 237 milliliter bottle that I got on Amazon for like 13 bucks. Um, it's not tested on animals. And this is great. It's odorless, unscented, easily absorbed, and 100% natural. And uh, magnesium oil is just something that you spray on areas where you're feeling sore or you're feeling tight or um, if you want to get a good night's sleep like it's got so many different um, remedies so it claims I personally find that it doesn't work for everything like I try using this on my feet because people say it makes them sleep better at night personally I don't find that that's the case for me but I do find that this helps tremendously with sore muscles with cramps with things in that department so if I work out and I'm really really sore I'll spray this on my areas or if I um, you know pull the muscle I'll spray this on that area before I go to sleep or during the day and it actually really does work this just claims that um, it improves sleep and skin reduces stress and anxiety relieves headaches oh that's another thing you can kind of spray this um, around your head area and supposedly alleviates that too alleviates body aches yes I believe it does and boosts energy levels I'm not sure about that just yet but you know I'll test it out a little bit more and um, basically it helps replenish your vital magnesium levels which is something that is naturally occurring in our bodies but uh, this helps to replenish that obviously since it's kind of magnesium oil in a bottle and it is one of the world's most powerful minerals and is found naturally beneath the earth's surface so because there are natural salts in this one of the downfalls the only drawback I find of this product is that if you do spray it on your skin it will kind of evaporate and leave kind of like a salty ish residue on your skin so you'll feel it on your feet if you're sleeping or whatever but um personally i think that the benefits are really really amazing and they outweigh that so i don't mind it too much at all but i think this is great it's totally worth the money for me and an essential in my lifestyle okay let's move on to that kind of situation like sleep sprays aromas um i think that this is great this is the mystic antidotes calming pillow spray with eucalyptus and mint you can find this at basically like any kind of discount stores ross tj maxx that's where i got mine got mine at tj maxx and essentially it contains like essential oils this one smells like eucalyptus and mint and this is really nice to kind of spray all over your pillows or your bed sheets before you go to sleep i don't do it too close to the pillow because i don't want like that to break me out but i just like having this overall if you do have an essential oil diffuser you can use that as well but for me sometimes for a quick easy fix and a portable one at that i like using this on my pillows and i find it does help me kind of relax myself before I go to sleep. I may have mentioned this in my how I de-stress video, I don't remember, but this is really good stuff and I think it's something that if you're struggling to go to sleep, these two are great. Also, another thing that I think is a lifestyle essential for me is the Lush Sleepy Lotion. This is a body lotion that looks like this. I mentioned this in my June favorites, I believe. It's so yummy. It smells like lavender honey and it's really, really hydrating. Like it kind of has like a little bit of a like thick, not greasy, but very, very emollient texture. I only use like half of a handful and I'm able to rub this all over my hands, my decollete, my feet, wherever. And I keep this on my nightstand and I feel that it does help me just kind of decompress and get ready for bed. So I think if you're looking for a product like this, this is amazing. It's $10 
for this size, which is 3.1 ounces, and then $20 for the bigger ounce. And I've had this since May, and I'm not even halfway through, so I do think that it is a good deal if you just use it before bed. Let's talk the obvious things. I can't live without candles. I can't clearly. I mean, I don't know if you can see the one burning in the back, but I'm so excited for fall and I know so many of you are like, oh my god, you're obsessed with like, the Pokemon candles, but no, I, I, I'm obsessed and it is totally a lifestyle essential. Every single night I come home from work, I put on a candle, I have different types of scents for the days. I honestly do think that it does help me tremendously with decompressing, with relaxing, with lifting my mood. There's different scents for different purposes. They just smell amazing. Like for example, the one I have right now, Fiji White Sands. That is a scent that I use during the daytime because it's very tropically beachy. It makes me want to sit out in the sun and it's sunny outside. So it's like perfectly fitting. Whereas a scent like this, which is Waffle Cone, it's more of like an evening scent because it's so delicious and warm and sweet and cozy. Like it's just amazing. And I cannot live without candles. They're an absolute lifestyle favorite of mine and I had to share them in this video. Okay, while we're on the topic of wellness, I want to talk about this. This is a head massager. I'm not sure if I spoke about this before, but it's great. I got this at an oxygen bar on the strip here in Vegas. I'm with my dad and my sister, and this is great. It has another attachment right here, and basically it's like one of these things, but it turns on. So you can really massage your head, and it does help if I feel like I have an incoming migraine or an incoming headache. Um, I will just kind of put this on and just, you know, super styling, massage it all over my head. It looks like a big old cake whisk, but you know, it's great. And the guy who sold it to us explained that, you know, you do have so many nerve endings in your head and I am prone to migraines and headaches. And this comes in handy. I keep it in my coffee table at, in my living room, just so that whenever I'm like chilling and I feel a headache, I can just reach for this and it does really really help i'm not sure where you can find this but i know that they make them out there somewhere like a lot and it's great and i totally recommend it if you are looking to buy an item that may not necessarily be the most obvious kind of like lifestyle thing but for me i think it is so so good and kind of moving into fitness this foam roller is so good and i i've said this to multiple people at work they're like oh my back hurts and i either say you need magnesium oil or you need a foam roller? I'd probably say both. Like if I'm like, do you have a foam roller? Yes. Have you tried magnesium oil? No. Then I'll say, you know, try this. But this is so good because this kind of tackles your sore muscles and your knots and your aches kind of like head on. I will typically like doing this every night before bed. I've spoken about this before, so I don't want to go into too much of detail, but um, it's pretty self-explanatory. You just kind of roll on your back, roll on your legs, roll on your arm, wherever you're feeling sore. And they also do have like the hand ones, like the manual ones that you'll just you know use whenever so i think it's great for your sore muscles for everything and it's absolutely essential for me and i cannot do without it people may be watching this video like why are you talking about dumbbells but to me i think they're one of those things that people don't realize you can get a full body workout in your home without having to go to the gym actually i mean i went to the gym yesterday because i don't have an elliptical like in my immediate apartment unit but um you can do like cardio there's a lot of full body workouts you can do on pinterest but dumbbells are one of those things that i don't feel like i have to leave the house in order to get strength training in i mean these are only five pound dumbbells but i use them in conjunction with each other and you can do so many different workouts ab workouts arm workouts leg workouts and use these as enhancers and you can do it straight in your living room and work up the same amount of sweat that you would work up in an hour-long session at the gym and i think these are so vital like i mean it's important to strength train it's important to keep your muscles and your bones healthy and to me dumbbells are one of those things that just aid with that wherever you are i mean you could be laying in bed you know just chilling watching tv and just lifting weights and i think it's worth it and you can find them everywhere so to me they're totally lifestyle essentials because they're one of those things that you can literally take anywhere do anywhere in your own home without having to go to the gym and to me it's kind of like i can't find an excuse to not work out because these are with me in my home and then after you get sore from lifting and doing different workouts with this you can use your oil you can use your foam roller to help you out so it's like a little full circle there you go okay i also want to talk about my um, himalayan salt lamp that's in my living room i'll insert a photo of it right now this is one that i got in virginia beach actually at a really nice um kind of wellness shop but you can find them everywhere you can find them online you can find them at discount stores they say salt lamps kind of like clean the air 
they radiate really good energy and they just help you feel more zen and I totally agree I mean I can't fully say like oh my energy is just automatically cleaner because I do keep it in my living room but I always have it on whenever um you know it's nighttime and I'm watching tv it's right by Maple's bed so I feel like it's good for her as well there has not been a single night where I have lights on but not my salt lamp I need my salt lamp on at all times it's great okay speaking of lights I want to talk about this this is um kind of like a non-battery powered flashlight my boyfriend actually got this for me I forget where um I can ask him but this is, I don't want to blind you, but it's great because it doesn't require batteries. It just has an on and off switch. It has a little strap like this, so you can carry it wherever. And I keep this with me on my nightstand, like right there. So, you know, if there is a blackout or a power surge, which we actually do get power surges here, not super frequently, but every once in a while because it can get very windy here in Las Vegas. It's always nice to have something on hand that doesn't require batteries, but can still provide you light. I mean, obviously I have an abundance of candles, but when I'm getting up in the middle of the night, if I do need need it I have it right with me and it is so essential to me I mean it's not something that I use every day obviously but I think it's one of those things that people might be like oh why didn't I think of that let me go get it I recommend it always good to be prepared I want to talk about my planner this is something that is so important to me because it is one of those things that people may be like oh you have a calendar and you have iCal and Google Calendar and online calendars and yeah I do but I need my planner to just write everything for me and i very picky about my planners i use one that um i think i mentioned in my what's in my bag video i use one that has a calendar format and then has weekly formats with a to-do checklist so that I can stay abreast of um what's going on overall during the week what's going on overall in the month and then what i need to do on a daily basis so this is great i got this one from target super cute compact fits perfectly in my bag i love taking it and you know this is like my favorite color ever so i love it a lot now the last two products i want to talk about are kind of like for specifically for women you know because why not so these are no show socks and i buy these in a pack oh not this one this one's a no show socks too but i'm specifically talking about this brand i will link the amazon link down below because i always buy them i buy them in a multi-pack of flesh um black and then a white variety these are the socks i wear like all the time i know a lot of no-show socks are very uncomfortable they slip down these stay on your feet they're amazing and i love how they kind of come up to like here so that you don't feel like your whole the middle of your foot is naked like it's very comfortable to wear with a bunch of different types of shoes flats um sneakers slip-ons espadrilles etc and i wear these every single day pretty much every single day if i'm not wearing um you know like boots or sandals these are so so nice and i think they're amazing and probably my number one lifestyle essential out of all of these because i genuinely use these daily i also want to mention this sticky bra it's kind of like i call them chicken cutlets there are a bunch of different kinds online but these are great for the woman who is wearing a strapless dress or a backless dress and doesn't want to hassle with bra straps these kind of come really really sticky and then you just kind of pop them on your boobs very very self-explanatory but to me these are something that are so essential they come for the roof for me whenever i need it and they come in a little pack like this so i can just zip it and keep it in my underwear drawer i think these are absolutely essential for anyone who um if you do have breasts and you're looking for an alternative solution to bra straps and bras and things like that these are great because you can also wear them for dresses like these even though it's like not revealing at all but i have worn them with regular clothes they're super super comfortable the only thing i would say is if you sweat a lot a lot a lot a lot they might come off eventually but i mean i went clubbing and it stayed on the entire time no issues i don't have to like press them in more so i definitely think they're really really good okay everyone and that is it for my favorite lifestyle essentials this was a roundup of my favorite health wellness um kind of random lifestyle things i hope you enjoy this video leave me a comment down below what is a lifestyle essential that you have in your collection that may be underrated not as talked about but is totally totally important and necessary for you i would love to know but thank you so much for watching don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and hopefully i will see you in my next video Mwah! bye guys